the main way I've been involved in the NIST PQC standardization effort is uh, by being a member of uh, the signature scheme Falcon, which has been selected for standardization. I was co-submitter of seven of the initial submissions, and all of those seven made it to round two, five made it to round three, and then eventually uh, now three were announced to be standardized, and another one made it to round four. And uh, basically, we made sure that we had a very complete team that contained people that were experts in implementation, experts in security, experts in design, and so on, in order to cover all the aspects of Falcon. It was big international teams, also composed of both uh, academia and industry. The team has been working really hard and investing a lot of time on Falcon for more than five years now, so of course it feels uh, like a huge validation to have NIST uh, standardize our design. Of course, it feels great that we won and that now three of the schemes that I co-designed will go into standardization and another one still has the chance of going into standardization later. I think one of the main reasons why Falcon was selected was because it was efficient and in particular it was extremely compact, meaning that the, the keys are small and so it's easy to send uh, keys and signatures. So I think our schemes were chosen because we managed to put together teams that really brought in expertise from all of the relevant sub-areas of post-quantum cryptography. The challenges we faced were the typical challenges that you're facing when you're working in a big group of people, and maybe even more so if it's a group of people who haven't worked together before, at least not all of them. We quickly realized that there were several topics that were all important, that we all had to study, and so this quickly became one of our main challenges. And I was very lucky because uh, the people in my team were all able to tackle every single one of these challenges. I think this announcement puts us in a very good place for the future. We've been advocating for many years with our clients that they need to adopt post-quantum cryptography in their products. And the fact that now there is a clear roadmap by NIST on what will be standardized and when it will be standardized, it makes it much easier for us and our clients to move forward.